controversy is more the L.A. Times. There was, let me get this correct. Sports Illustrated's readers voted American Pharaoh Sports Person of the Year. Yeah. The magazine gave the award to Serena Williams yeah, because, properly. Yeah, because she's a human. And they just feel like she had a better season <laughs> than American Pharaoh. Uh, but the L.A. Times just asked the question via Twitter, should... Serena Williams be the sports person of the year over American Pharaoh, and they ran Serena's picture in American Pharaoh. And people say, oh, my God, are you comparing Serena to a horse? And the next thing you know, the L.A. Times is, is apologizing. And I'm like, this is a joke. First of all, there's nothing to apologize for. They were asking a question like, do readers really think that this horse should be sports person of the year they weren't. over American Pharaoh? And so they were kind of asking the question sarcastically. And, and appropriately, is, it, is this really what you think? Is Serena so despised or so people disrespect her accomplishments so much that we're going to give this award to a horse? But some people thought, oh, it's just crazy. How can you put a picture of a horse and Serena next to each other? And I just think it's a joke. It's like we want to turn Serena into this victim. All the time. Her whole narrative oh, is God. framed in victimhood. She made and oh, my more. God. Than every NFL player not named Peyton Manning last year in endorsement. I understand. I understand that. And so we want to do this victim narr narrative that Serena, I don't even think, really believes in. There are no champions that see themselves as a victim first. They fight off their obstacles to become champions. That's what makes you a champion. And so you have all these outsiders that don't understand Serena, don't understand sports culture, don't understand what it takes to be great in this world. And you're going to have to overcome obstacles. Everybody, if you wanted to tell your story as a victim story, you could, Colin. You could, oh, my God. I don't, I'm don't. i sure things went on in your past, in your oh, history, yeah. your family or whatever. But, but you chose not to. You chose, like, no, I'm going to overcome and become as great as I can be. That's what Serena has done, and we should be celebrating that, her champion spirit. And, you know, the, the fact that... She struggled in the past because in her prime, Serena wasn't as focused and as determined as she is now. Yeah. She wasn't as good a shape as she is now. Yeah. And so it's 34, late in her career, where she's at her highest level. There were some of us that was like, no, she should have been this great even earlier, and this should have been her second or third Sports Person of the Year award. But, again, she's not a victim. She's uh, a champion. 